Don't be fooled. Life is full of traps, and they're out to specifically get you. There are a lot of things you can do to mess up your life, and a lot of those things are really hard to get out of. Whether it's debt or getting caught up in the daily rat race, there are just so many pits you can fall into. Sometimes you won't even realize you're in the pit. So on today's list, we're not just going to show you how to avoid the big ones, because most of those involve finances and money to some extent, but we'll also touch on some of the less serious traps, like running out of toilet paper. That always stinks. Pun intended. Wow. <laughs> It's time to identify and avoid some of the most common life traps most people fall into at least once in their lives. To avoid any confusion, a life trap is any device, physical or psychological, that catches or retains a person and offers no immediate escape. Life traps can be physical objects, psychological beliefs, and or specific situations. Now that we have that established, you ready? Because we're about to drop some knowledge on you. You're about to learn what you need to look out for in your daily life. This won't make you a pro, but it might just keep you from being dirt poor. At least I hope. I'm Michael List 25 and these are 25 life traps that most people fall into at one point or another. Boo for that pun. Boo. <laughs> That's a trap. I trapped you into puns. Twenty five gamblers fallacy. This is the idea that if something happens a lot, you flip heads 50 times in a row, then the other option is more likely to happen. You'll start flipping tails more. This superstitious belief comes from the idea that the universe must balance out somehow. It's caused a lot of pain to people's wallets in Las Vegas. Uh, I know something about uh, I play d and I once rolled six ones in a row and I think we learned the Probability of that is astronomical. 24. Pressing spacebar to pause a YouTube video and scrolling halfway down the page. Try K instead. You're welcome. Although not this one. Don't pause this one. Keep watching. Never pause our videos. 23. Making eye contact with kiosk workers at the mall. You'll never get that five minutes back. 22. Thinking you're not affected by marketing. Marketing isn't just advertising. It's sneaky in ways you never would have expected. Even their very floor you are standing on in some stores can be designed to subconsciously influence your comfort, perception, and movement. Thumbnails. 21. Thinking you have to go to college. There are plenty of people that make an excellent living without any degree. Preach. However, they do have a degree of intelligence. Unless you want to be a doctor or a lawyer, go to college. No, don't. Just start cutting people open. No, don't. <laughs> 20. Lifestyle inflation. As we make more money, we spend more money. Unfortunately, this leads many people to maintain a paycheck-to-paycheck -paycheck lifestyle. An alternative, especially for those of you living in high-income economies, saving and then investing to achieve financial freedom. Preach again. <laughs> 19. You don't have to be here for that one. I was I just going to do it to the we, camera. I think we need to. Go on. Do you? Yes, go on. You're on the wrong side. I just get the hell out of here. Get over here. No. Move. Ow. <laughs> Why did we punch you? No, other? just go right there. Do it. Hey, what's on your shirt? What? Boop. Mm. I felt wrong being on that side. I'm going to do it again. Hey, what's on your shirt, Invisible Tristan? Boop. Got him. Nailed it. Don't fall for that, kids. 18. Running out of toilet paper. There are two types of people in the world. Those who have experienced this, and those who will. 17. Sunk cost fallacy. This is the idea that simply because people have already invested in something, $300 for a conference you don't really want to go to, they will actually invest more in spite of the fact that their initial investment is a dud. I might as well spend more money going to the conference. 16. Pushing the biggest download button. You'll, you'll regret it. 15. Pyramid schemes. If you don't fall for it, then you definitely had at least one friend who did. 14. Scarcity trap. When you're experiencing poverty with regards to time, money, happiness, then you're more likely to make decisions that amplify and lead to more poverty. 
It's basically a self-fulfilling prophecy, i.e. depression leads to isolation, which leads to more depression, etc. Negative feedback loops are no fun. Whoa, depression. <laughs> I have depression. 13, trying to please people. As you get older, you realize that no matter what you do, people will find some way to criticize you, huh? You didn't help the homeless man, you're a bad person. You help the homeless man, you're an enabler. You run a YouTube channel with facts, they're all wrong, kill yourself. Can I keep that? <laughs> 12, the Spanish prisoner. This confidence trick is essentially the original Nigerian prince scam, but more generalized. For example, politicians do this all the time by dishing out empty promises. Vote for me and I'll completely change so and so. In reality, they're just using you to further their own agenda. 11, not backing your files up. <laughs> that file's not important, right? Yeah, not until your computer crashes. 10, dead. If you live in the United States, this is especially relevant. Don't drink the Kool-Aid. You can live without debt. Circling back around to that whole college thing, aren't we? Nine, climbing the ladder. This not only pertains to work, but life in general. We want a better job to buy a bigger house for which we will need an even better job so that we can then buy yet another house. Repeat. Eight, getting a credit card for reward points. I'm sorry. Remember what I said about marketing? Seven. Pfft, I'll remember that, no need to write it down. What, what was that thing again? Uh, I'm terrible at that with ADHD. I am so bad at that. You owe me money. You owe me money. Six, trusting your memory. Your memory is notoriously bad. Yours, not mine, I have steel trap. Things like the Mandela effect show how millions of people can remember something that never happened. Nelson Mandela dying in prison. So basically, just because you firmly remember something, you're very likely wrong about it in more ways than you would expect. Five, taking a quick break to check Facebook. <laughs> yeah, right. It'll be quick, huh? Okay. Four, thinking you didn't use too much toilet paper and it'll flush. The toilet is especially unlikely to flush when you're at a friend's house. Three, thinking that you know. This goes along with trusting your memory and tribalism, which we'll get to. We all make this error at some point. We are so sure of our position that we are unwilling to entertain or accept the fact that other opinions might carry some validity. Two, tribalism. This is possibly the biggest trap we fall into as humans other than sand traps and pits and quicksand. Those are Whatever dangerous. Whatever number one on this list. Whatever, <laughs> Whatever number one is. On a big scale, this leads to racism and nationalism, but this affects us on every level of life. Do you think all the people that believe or follow, insert belief here, are terrible? That's tribalism. Sports, countries, jobs, it's everywhere. An upside, it leads to community. The downside, however, is that it can easily lead to wars and conflict. Ironically enough, thinking that you are above tribalism due to intelligence or political persuasion is a form of tribalism itself. One. <laughs> All serious. <laughs> spiderwebs. Who hasn't walked into a spiderweb? And besides, it's probably the most literal trap on this list. So, what life traps have you fallen for? Let us know in the comments below or tweet your answers to us at list25. Bear traps. There was that one in uh, the, the bear trap in Walking Dead where you, uh, you had to either pry it off the thing or cut off the dude's leg. I cut off his leg. I tried to pry him off open at first. Oh, I shot him too. You shot him? <laughs> God. Look out for bear traps, guys. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button on the bottom right and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.